Good morning guys and welcome to today's vlog. So we are at a studio right now. We're about to film my video for this week. If you guys have been watching for a while, you might remember we actually used to shoot at this studio for Luca and Gray before we started doing everything in Salt Lake. So it's kind of fun to be back here because we haven't been here in literally probably like almost a year, I would say. I'm going to do an outfits video this week. So it's gonna be kind of just some like fun fall outfits. I'm just gonna stand right here and basically just be like trying on all my outfits. And then I'll like fast forward through the part of me like actually trying them on. We got our camera set up, the usual setup for main channel videos. 1DX, 16 to 35, got my cute little setup. Hopefully this turns out good because it's kind of supposed to be like a one take video. So I'm literally just gonna go stand there try on every single outfit and then during the time where i'm like i might have literally just said this but when i'm changing outfits that'll be like fast forwarded and then it'll go to normal speed and i'll like actually show the outfit i can't remember you just said that you guys know i have like literally short-term memory loss the point is it's supposed to be like a one take video so i can't really like mess up or like talk in it or anything so i'm kind of nervous i mean if i have to make a cut somewhere it'll be up. fine because what if i look like an idiot or something or you can like see my butt we actually love when i film videos like this where i don't have to talk because because we can like listen to podcasts and YouTube videos and stuff. So it's kind of just like relaxing and fun. We used to film a lot of videos like this in like 2015, 2016, just at our house and stuff when it was like life hacks and like all that stuff. And it was always just like B-roll and voiceover. And those videos were always just so fun because when we filmed, we just got to like sit and hang out. Here's the setup. Aspen's over here. She can't really like look up and talk to me. And like, it's kind of funny. She can't really uh, do anything. She doesn't want it to seem like, I don't know, what would happen? Your face would just be like moving a bunch and I guess it wouldn't be that clean of a video. So she won't talk to me. We're listening to a views podcast with uh, Jason Nash and David Dobrik. I'm gonna set you guys up, do a little time lapse. So good news, my video actually turned out so cute and I'm super happy with it and I'm so excited. And it was really quick for me to edit. So I actually finished the entire thing. It's a few hours later and it literally turned out perfect. I really like the video. So I'm super excited for you guys to see it on Sunday. Parker's family's actually in town. Um, his sister's running the marathon tomorrow. Baby Ollie's here. She's almost 11 months old in like three days maybe. So yeah, that was like the fastest almost year of my entire life. But anyways, super excited about my video. Wearing one of the dresses right now. I'll link it down below. You guys can't really see it. It's actually super long, but yeah, I'm really, really excited. So, all right guys, so I filmed that clip yesterday and then we didn't get any more footage for the rest of the day. So it is the next day now. Today's the day of the marathon. So Cassidy, I think she probably has like one or two miles left. So we're about to go to the finish line and see her. So we're super excited for her. That is a freaking amazing goal. We just parked, Parker had to parallel park. Usually the area when you're in the driver's ed and stuff, the area they teach you to parallel park is at the temple. And he was like, oh, cause that's like where we parked just barely. It's like a church building. And he's like, oh, I'm parallel parking like right where I learned to. And it just reminded me that I was taught how to do that and I passed my test on it But I also don't know how to parallel park comment down below if you do I feel like if I had to figure it out I obviously could but like the technique and stuff that you learn like I do not remember that at all We gotta hurry She's probably finishing right now. Oh, okay We also have to walk a little bit because it's super super busy. So let's go We're gonna speed walk, okay? What a nice job that only took you like 10 seconds no, I'm good check at out it. that parking. All right, check it out. There's the finish line. Parker just called. They're at mile marker 24, so they have like two more to go. Ollie, is your mom running? How cute are you in your little bear suit? Yay! You did it! Ollie, girl! Hey! Are you having fun? Mm -hmm. Are you having fun? <laughs> Mara, show everybody your hair. Wow, so long, <laughs> so cute. You're so big now, huh? Can you climb the tree? Oh, you almost got it, girl. Keep going, keep trying. All right, guys, so we're about to give Parker a little test of is he ready to be a dad? So far, the answer is no. <laughs> we have Ollie's stroller with us. It's like 10 minutes to and figure out how to open it now. We don't know how to close yeah, it. Yeah, we can't figure out how to shut it. So Wouldn't it like, do you squeeze these? No. Oh, can we just stick it in the back of the truck? Yeah, we could. Is it this oh, look, that switch? Pulls it down. 
We have no idea. It was what? It was like the best experience I've ever had. On oh, a bike. new new bike. My new bike. And Parker seriously. got a new bike today. Yes, we sir. are back home after the marathon. We grabbed some lunch hey, and. Wait, wait, wait. Speaking of my new bike ride, I'm gonna insert some footage right now. Parker got a new GoPro and it like stabilizes itself, which is really cool. But anyways, when we were gone, Lauren texted me and she was like, oh, I thought you were gonna be home, so someone's gonna call you in like 30 minutes, which they never actually called me, but I was telling her this morning that I was sad because it's been really hard for the past few weeks since she moved. So she sent me a present. Look how nice. We have like no fruit, so I'm so happy. And this cute little balloon. See, that's why I cry, because she moved, because she's the best friend ever. Boo-boo, look how cute. The present that she got me. That is cute. That you didn't get me. Yeah. Husband is jealous that best friend got wife present. What? <laughs> husband Are you didn't get this one. So that this can be the title? <laughs> yeah, guys, so we don't, we don't right have now. a title for the video. I'm so jealous. Seriously, I'm just <laughs> jealous. All right, my room is a mess because we filmed a fashion video yesterday. It's going to be up. I think we're uploading this on Monday, so it went up Sunday. So, link is down below to my new video. I wore this sweater in it. It was like a lookbook, and it actually, I thought it turned out super cute. It was really fun to film. So, I got this cute sweater that I'll link down below, and then these are like my go-to pants. So, I'll also link these down below, and then all of these outfits, sneak peek, these are linked down below in my video on my main channel. So... Check it out. All right guys, so to end today's vlog, we have a super exciting house update. We are officially moving in one month. A is month it, from yesterday. Yeah, a month from yesterday, well. Cause isn't today the eighth? That is the day that we get the keys to the house that we move in. Yes. Are we for sure gonna move, you want yes. to move in that day? Yes. Yeah, so today's the eighth. Our closing date is the seventh and they told us that up until 30 days before they like, once it's 30 days before your closing date, they can't push it back. As far as we know, they can't push it back because today's the 8th and we close on November 7th. So there's less than 30 days. Yep. So I'm super excited. I don't know, you guys probably didn't notice over here, but we normally have some like shelves and a painting and stuff. So I started taking some of that stuff down. So slowly but surely, we're doing it. Yeah, this is we're a, moving. kind of a crazy, surreal feeling. I know, I feel like, I feel it like it's not even real. Yeah, it hasn't hit me one bit. And it probably won't hit me until we're like living up there for like yeah, a month. I think and then I'm like, too. wait. I know, it's, especially there's with the snow, snow on the ground. What the yeah. crap? Yeah, it's kind of a crappy time to move because of the weather. But we're super excited. So yeah, officially in one month we will be moved. So I'm going up to Salt Lake this weekend and then we have a weekend at home and then I'm going to New York for a weekend. Then I have another weekend at home and then we'll be moving. Yep. So we're super excited. We'll insert, we only have like one new picture of the house. We just get updates from our builder every Friday. So it's looking really good. They just painted the inside this week. So now they, I don't really know what else they're doing. What are they doing this week? They're, they're doing tile. Oh, they're installing the cabinets this week. Yeah, cabinets. So that'll be exciting. We'll try to do weekly updates every week until we move so that you guys can kind of like stay up to date because I know that it's not as fun as when we built this house because we can't go and drive by every day. But yeah, we'll officially be moved in a month from yesterday. So we're super excited, but we hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure you guys thumbs up and subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, Bye guys. guys.